what's up hi everyone johar and well back welcome back to my channel lens provoker and and if you don't want to share but uh, i'm doing this because i really feel pity for my village over there and yesterday the two firefighter lost their lives and it was really depression to see such scene actually they were, might have died already in the night itself because when there was a heavy blue heavy blow of the fire they wanted to escape from it but in order to get in order to escape from that they got uh, they fell into the river and from there uh, they just uh, could not uh, swim or could not uh, do anything they died in the river itself so people were searching here and there they couldn't find so later on the engineer and the rp team came and searched the whole location and they found the two dead bodies over there the durlok gogoi and kilishwar gogoi So I pray that the soul will be in rest in peace and condolences to the family. It's very heartening to see the two guy fighting for fighting for fighting to save other people and they just lost their own life. They sacrificed it. So how did it actually happen? and how did it broke up with the fire just little bit of uh, syntax i'll just give it to you so that you may know clearly what it has happened actually on 27 may around like yeah, 10 15 to i think 10 30 so there was more going on so they wanted to to bore it till deeper and wanted to get into contact with that Uh, the gas location area so as they were walking on it and the drilling was going on the pressure was little higher the higher than the normal so because of that maybe because of heavy rock or something because of that it uh, what pushed to little higher pressure and that's the reason the gas automatically dewarped from the earth it is something around like uh, 3900 meter beneath the earth so almost like a 4 uh, km almost almost like a 4 4 km below so still it is coming out and it is now destroyed everything and may take around like 3 or 4 weeks to dose of the fire and hope so the oil man, oil team in the DSM management team has said that it may take around like 3 4 weeks to settle the to dose of the fire and they are working on it first of all they will clear all the debris over there and they will make the pond they will fill the water over there and they will just uh, try their every plan of method watch they have what they have and the what how they have planned to do the fire so this is this the thing which has happened ever in the history of assam and it is a, and it has spread to around like 4 to 500 meter of the radius area and this very uh, devastating to see such a scene and dibuso case just near my um, thank god it didn't went that side because the oil was also even floating on the river because from the before, from the 14 days it was spreading and the oil the oil has completely settled down in whole of the area and covered the every green grass and plants and uh, trees and therefore the fire when when they 
day for yesterday when they yesterday when the war when they supposed to go for for put up the fire um, and uh, no the put up the gas to block the bolt so due to some friction of war due to some work due to some friction the fire broke out from there some war was going on so so because and also heat was uh, there was too much of heat from the sun time and because of that activity it caused a wildfire and it has spread to vast area and many houses were destroyed goes were destroyed animals were destroyed property destroyed the garden destroyed when the all india lost there are many vehicles machines the fire brigade lost their vehicles even the fire brigade also water tank also got burned up so very very heavy heavily lost for the industry and for the people over there i feel really feel sad by seeing and seeing so this is just few of my briefing and just few given to you and please share and subscribe to my channel and if you like it please like and comment